Good morning, y'all. Baby, you don't know what you do to me. Between me and you, I feel I can't. Uh, it's your girl Big Cash Cash back in again with another video. You already know the freaking vibes. Welcome, welcome back to the channel. If you're new, make sure you like, comment, subscribe, and click that below. Wait, click that. Wait, what the fuck? Make sure y'all click that bell so you can be notified when I post and join Cash's crew because the vibes here are immaculate, but y'all already knew that. Y'all, as you see by the title, I'm doing a little vloggy vlog today. I'm going thrifting today. Well, I'm doing more than thrifting, and I'm going to take y'all with me. Some of it, I'm going, where am I going? I'm going to Ulta, the thrift store, Goodwill. I'm going to Walmart, and then I'm going somewhere else, but I don't remember. I'm going somewhere else, so I don't remember. But basically, this video is mainly going to be about, like, thrifting. But I'm going to show y'all a little bit more of my day, too. I'm going to show y'all what I get at Ulta and stuff like that. But a little disclaimer, I'm not sick, but my allergies are whipping my ass, and I'm on my period. So a bitch is feeling a little uh today. But it ain't nothing but a thing. We still gonna get to it. We still gonna go through our day. We still gonna be blessed for another day. But just, you know, keep that in mind if I sound nasally, you know, shit like that. Um, I'm not gonna show y'all getting dressed or nothing just because I'm literally gonna do bare nothing. Like, I'm not gonna wear no type of makeup. I'm gonna do my eyebrows. But And then I'm gonna do my hair and throw on a very chill fit because, like I said, a bitch is cramping. I'm not trying to be in nothing tight, none of that. So... Yeah, that's the vibes right now. I'm watching iCarly. And next time you see me, I'll be all dressed up and ready to head out. Letting the camera focus. Okay, I'm back. This is what I'm looking like today. It's a real chill fit. Honestly, I wanted this shirt. Is this going to sit up? I wanted this shirt to be like a, um, I wanted to wear it like a t-shirt dress, but it just didn't work out the way I wanted it to. So I had to throw on some gray shorts and I just have some white Air Force Ones. And this is going to fit for today. I'm not going to lie. I am cramping so bad, but I just took some medicine. So we're going to hope that that kicks in super fast because like I can't do it. I'm not going to be able to enjoy my day. Unless this kicks in, because I'm going to be fighting these cramps all day. Either way, the first place we're going to go to is Starbucks, because I want to try a new drink. I found it on um, TikTok. I want to try an iced coffee. I've been in the mood for iced coffee, not like a frappuccino, like straight iced coffee. So that's what I'm going to try. It's like this. It's like iced coffee with five punts of caramel. I don't know. It's this like extra long order, which I kind of feel bad about, because... I don't feel bad, but I feel like that's, like, extra. Like, the people are going to have to actually make it. It's not, like, a set-in-stone drink that's already made. But I want to try it, so it's going to have to do. Why is it that when you get in the car, it be so hard to breathe when it's hot outside? Like, is the air, like, supposed to be non-existent or something when you get in a hot car? Narco, narco, got dope like Pablo. Pablo, cut dope like Pablo. Cut dope, chop tree with the Draco. Draco, on the north got Diego. Diego. Say I still a wiggle. Y'all yeah, want another drink I'm about to try? I saw it on TikTok. Supposedly, it's a venti iced coffee with half and half cream, five punts of caramel, extra caramel drizzle, and whipped cream on top. So hopefully it's good because I don't like trying new things, but I'm going out on a limb today to try this. Okay, so I just got the drink, and what a coincidence, there's an Ulta lady right there, so we're about to go to it, but look, it looks really good, so we're about to try it. Mm. This is actually kind of good. So, like I said, it's good, but like... iced coffee you could like definitely taste the coffee in it unless i'm not stirring, stirring enough like you know the coffee drinks in vanilla like I, how do i get that drink with like some caramel drizzle because those be good with ice when i make them at home so we're definitely in a nice part of whatever area i'm in right now but the ultra's right there so that's what we gotta go check out there's soap because that's what i'm looking for Oh, I just got this because I saw this girl on TikTok use this pencil as, like, highlighter. But she said she used the one called Cashmere. But there literally isn't one called Cashmere. So, she was lying to the media. That old time I went to had about negative amount of things that I wanted. 
So I may just go to a different one later. If I saw if I see one close to near where the thrift stores are at. This is all the pants they got for the men's section. Those are drawn on. <laughs> they ain't got shit in here, and I was big hyped to come in here. And they got about negative stuff. Kids is down there. Look, I thought this was a flannel. I was about to get it, and it's a fucking robe. Or else that would have been cute. I'm actually disappointed. Look at this little tote bag. Kids' clothes. Oh my god, that's cute. shit in there and we really had our hopes up that it was going to be something good and like I love the Goodwill don't get me wrong but why is it right when you touch ground in that bitch you start itching like my legs started itching out of nowhere and then I had to use the bathroom so I had to get out of that one but we're about to look up a new one and hopefully we get better luck that one was like wiped out like they literally didn't have shit and people are walking out like it's good like People are walking out with stuff, so I'm like, there has to be stuff in there. Nah, there was not. Can I change? And it is. Keep off in the main. In my nips. We like it. You can't. Drop it top. Drop it. Let it breathe. I don't want no Texas people, Texas native, because I'm not a Texas native. But I don't want nobody coming from her neck. But in all honesty, y'all motherfuckers don't know how to drive, and that's just the end of it. I won't let no one come and take your place. Cause the love you give, you can't be replaced. So go now. Tell me I shouldn't buy this right now. But there's a stain on the back and it's just like way too big. Look, I found this Daytona Beach zip up. I'm debating about it. And they're mad because they have a lot of good jeans. Like they have a lot of rock wear and they have baby fat and all this shit. But not in my damn size. Oops, I didn't that back. Like look at these. But not in my size. These are too damn little for me. to right now but the last thrift store we were at it was actually kind of good it like you saw in the video i said it had a lot of good jeans like it had rock wear it had miss me jeans baby fat like all the stuff i would be looking for just not in my size or at least how i would want it to fit it also had some nice like it had a nice, a nice um like shirts jackets stuff like that just not how i would want them to fit but i did get a sweater and then two zip ups that i'm gonna show you later and then i just left the ulta because like i said i was gonna go to a different one and they actually had the jumbo stick in white which i haven't seen anywhere like the plain matte white and then 
they had the one that I saw the girl use for a highlighter. And then I'm going to try this NYX eyebrow flick. Because I'm trying to do my eyebrows differently. Because obviously what I've been doing, it's like not working no more. Which I've been knew that. But I don't know. I'm going to see how this pen is. And then I still have to find the soap. Because I know you could get that soap at Ulta. Because I got it there before. I don't know if they discontinued it. But I can't find it there no more. Turn me inside out, out, make my heart beat. Leave no one else, you're all I need. Personality. These be tight, big. That's why I like these ones. But we gonna see if this has good stuff in it. But they playing music, so you already know I gotta go. one thing there i'm gonna show you that later but i was like we were driving um like back to go to the house type shit but then i found like this foot action and this foot locker and champs that's like in the middle of nothing like it seems like it's like a mall but it's disconnected but we're just gonna stop here and see if they got anything it's not that i don't Okay, y'all, so I made it back home, and I was gonna do this haul outside, but it's literally dark outside, and I didn't know it was that dark. So we're gonna go ahead and just wrap it up in here. Um, I did go to Walmart. And then I went to that last thrift, which it was cool, it was okay, but it wasn't nothing like spectacular. I only found one thing, but yeah, I went to Walmart and I got one thing. I literally got a heating pad because like I said, your girl is cramping and heating pads are like a lifesaver. So yeah, I went to Walmart and I was looking for the pear soap, but I guess they don't have it either. I don't know where I'm going to find it now since it's for some reason nowhere to be found. But I have this heating pad that is just a quick essential. It was like $15. I literally wanted to get the cheapest one. I did not want to spend no more extra money on no extra shit. But before I throw these thrift clothes in the Goodwill, I'm going to go ahead and show you what I got. So the first thing is the zip up that I showed y'all. This like Harley Davidson. Um, is this Harley Davidson? Daytona Beach? Is that the same shit? I don't even know, but it's a zip up. I feel like honestly this zip up would probably go for like a lot if it was like in some reselling store, you know? And I like that it's a zip up and not a hoodie. Because if it was a hoodie, I wouldn't have got it. But this was like $3. I'm not going to lie you. And then I got this sweater, which I can't really tell you why I got it. I just thought it was cute. It was giving me very much like... um christmas vibes of course but like i saw two of these and this one i liked a little bit more i probably wouldn't actually wear this out but like this is cute like like i don't know it just gives me cute christmas vibes so yeah it looks like this and i like the little v-neck i feel like if i did wear it out i'd wear it with like some gold chains like a thick chunky chain and then some like not skinny pants but like Maybe like biker shorts or something. Something small underneath since the top is like so oversized. And then I got this jacket and I got these to go with my Reeboks. I'm going to wear it with other stuff, but mainly I got it to go with my Reeboks. But did y'all see the matching sets they had? Like I was actually surprised they had sets. Like one thing I can say about that um, thrift store is that it was really organized. It was color coded, which I really liked. For some reason, the women's stuff was a little bit more out of um, order. Like it wasn't as organized the best. 
than the men's but probably because it was probably harder to do since the women's had like more patterns and stuff the only thing i didn't like is nothing was like sized like you literally were just looking and you had a guess so like looking for jeans and stuff was kind of or like pants or bottoms was kind of hard because nothing was like sized but this is the other zip up like tell me this does not look like different like i think it looks really cool and then the pockets are like just right in the front and they're like just open I don't know. I thought it was really cute, so I got them, and I thought they would go really nice with those Reeboks that I got. If y'all haven't seen them, go watch my, what is it, my birthday, what I got for my birthday pickups. So, what I got from the next thrift was just, like I said, one thing, and it's these Adidas sweats. Now, I wish they weren't Adidas because I don't, do, I don't have no Adidas. I have Yeezys, and that's it. But they're baby blue and it has like a line on the side and they're like a relaxed fit you see what i mean so they'll like lay over my shoes nicely and it has a thing in the middle i mean on the inside so i can make the waist smaller if it was too big so i just had to get these i'm probably gonna wear this these sweats no i definitely am gonna wear these sweats with non-adidas shoes but y'all just gonna have to mind your business when it comes to that point because in reality i don't care so now I'm going to show y'all what I got from Ulta. And I kind of already told y'all what I got. I got the jumbo pencils, which I got that white one, which I'm going to use, obviously, as like a highlighter. You know, I white eyeliner, stuff like that. And then I also have this one, which I'm going to use as a highlighter that I saw the girl on TikTok use. I don't know what this color is. Like, none of these, they don't say the color on them. This may be the one that she had, but literally this doesn't say the color, like, at all. And then I got this NYX Lift and Snatch, and it looks like the pencil is supposed to be really, really small, which is what I want. Look, let me try to focus it in on y'all. It looks like it's supposed to be really thin and, like, precise, which is what I want, so I can make, like, strokes of hair. So we're going to hope that it comes out good, because if not, I will be returning it. Um, I wanted to try it, though, with the pair of soap. Like, I really wanted to try that, but I don't know. I'm going to have to keep looking. And then, you know how the last place, I think the last place that I showed y'all was when I went to the Foot Action Champs in Foot Locker. I didn't record the Foot Locker or Champs because I was rushing because it was about to close. But Foot Action came through, and I was debating if I should get these or not. And the sizing for New Balances, this is my first pair of New Balances, but the sizing for New Balances must run small because these are nine and a half but they fit almost perfect like they fit like fine so i got them y'all y'all cannot tell me this wasn't like a good cop these were only 75 bucks and they're like these oh this damn tag tell me this isn't the perfect colorway like i know this whole trip i've been getting hella shoes like i know this whole t like i know i've been getting hella shoes the past couple of days but after after this i'm done like i'm actually done but y'all can't tell me this wasn't a must like this is like the perfect colorway this is some shoe that you would see on tiktok but couldn't find nowhere and that's why this was like the last size it was like this size or like a size six and y'all just can't tell me these aren't perfect like it's shades of like brown and nude it's literally gonna go with everything and it's literally a perfect fall shoe so yeah i got these i know i got a lot of questions like i posted on the copper drop on my instagram and hella people were like what are these called get them blah 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 hella people were saying cop fast so i was like honestly i'll be stupid if i didn't so i went back and i did cop those and i am happy about it i do not regret but y'all that is the end of this video um i hope y'all enjoyed this little vloggy vlog and comment down below more video suggestions and if i should vlog more i'm really into like getting into more casual and like vlog videos i like doing those so yeah if you like them too let me know i'm about to get ready for bed and wind down so yeah don't forget to go follow me on all my socials at big cash cash especially on instagram and tiktok if you want to see my outfits talk to me more one-on-one -on -one, stuff like that i love talking to y'all i'm gonna wrap this video up though i'm gonna see you on the next video and thank you so much for watching